Well, we've just seen a great run, but here, here's a man and a dog, Gwilym Rice Jones from Breckford representing the South with Queen, who can put up an equally good run, and they need 87 points to keep the South in contention. Queen, swinging left, way, way out. The idea is to, is to go out as far as you can so that you can get in purposely to get in behind the sheep without them knowing you're there. So you've got to take a wide out run, you've got to take it on the mountain to turn your sheep in when you're gathering. And a collie is trained, is instructed, is taught to do this. And there's Queen coming right round. She's getting encouragement, she's getting faulted. She's getting encouragement as she goes to a sheep. And Willem is quite capable of putting up a jolly good challenging run to Lynn Jones and, and Taff. And he's dropped two on his out run, and he's clean on his lift. Nice trotting away from the post, which gives you a good lift. But he's already lost two points. And don't forget, we've only seven to play with. That's five to go. These sheep are coming well. Queen's there behind them. And she's experienced. She knows what it's all about as well. Through the, through the fetch gates, but, but offline, offline there. She just pressed on a little too far. But steady, steady. We're just getting the waves and the waggles, which mean the points have been lost. She's just pressing too much, and those sheep have got to run on them. When sheep start running, you lose that perfect control that is so necessary. Practical shepherding, yes, but it, uh, in competitions, just to be that little bit more specific and more precise. And she's going to drop some points on the fetch, I'm afraid. And we're looking for a tight turn. Grand little three-coloured bitch, tri-coloured. Represented Wales many, many times. Willem, of course, a past master at the art of handling two dogs. And she's dropped four on the fetch. That's six altogether. But against Taff's seven. As he starts his drive away. But this is a joy to watch as well. She, she's in control. She's going away nicely. Gwilym Gwil Jones and Queen there seem to be putting the pressure on these sheep. Do you think that's a wise move on this particular course? I think he's put a bit of pressure on the fetch, I think, just to give him a little bit of time, I think. And perhaps he thinks the sheep will stick together better. But uh, he's got a sort of bitch that can um, at sort of adapt. He can um, slow down and slow the pace whenever he wants to, I think. She's Queen. a you know, very, very experienced bitch, this. She's quite an old lady too, isn't she? Yes, and I would, I would think that she will um, sort of rate as one of the great bitches in Wales, actually. In my opinion, anyway. She must be, what, a ten, is she's, it? Somewhere around yes, she's somewhere around ten year old, yes. And unfortunately, perhaps coming to the end of her great uh, career she's had. Gwilym was saying that he's used to working heavier sheep than this at Brachfa. Uh, do you think that he might push them a bit too hard and split them up? Mm. I don't think so, no. I think the bitch is far too experienced. Um, she's got a real good head on her, and she'll... I think she'll cope with these. She'll make a good job of it. In fact, he's making too good a job at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> Friendly rivalry. <laughs> Queen going grand. Just watch it. Just watch that. Oh, we we down below the cross dive ball. Down below. Wrong. Of course. Well down below. And that's let a lot of points go. That's dropped a lot of points. And Queen's gone into the ditch, just like Taft did. But she's quickly out. And she plods on the old girl. Knows what it's all about. 
of the most experienced dog, and she's going to miss. She's just too late to turn them up there, and she splits the packet. And finally, only a couple of sheep go through the gate, and I'm afraid that's where, that's where it's lost. The points have gone there. The points have gone with coming below the cross drive post, but an experienced bitch, she keeps at it, she sticks at it, and an adapt adaptable. She'll take any sort of sheep on. I've seen her work with sheep of all types and all breeds. She's represented Wales that often that she's, she's had to master Scottish sheep, English sheep, Welsh sheep, that lot. And this little bitch can do it. One of, one of the best dogs that Wales has known in a time. Plodding, trotting, into the shedding ring. Willem watches her come into the ring. <whistles> Calmly carries on. Must know now that he's, he's lost this particular heat, but a team competition, don't forget. Team competition, every point counts. <whistles> Comes into the shedding ring, end of the drive. Good lass, Dad. good lass, good queen. Bye. Done. <coughs> ten sheep, ten sheep. Willem moves up towards them on the black colours. You see them over Willem's right hand shoulder. The Bye. three sheep with black colours on. Those are the three sheep that we Done. want to be that we want to end with. We want to get rid of the of the other seven. Those are the three sheep that we've got to put into the into the uh, pen, and the judges have uh, informed us that they've lost. Willem and Queen have lost 12 points on driving, so that of course puts him well behind uh, Glyn Jones with Daff. But that team competition is still wide open. We keep calm, we keep quiet. He's obviously, he knows that he's lost the personal battle with Glenn Jones and Taft, but keeping, keeping going, seeking those points, seeking those points to keep the, to keep the South in contention. Three minutes to go. Still we plod on, looking for those points. Unflappable. This is the mark of a of a great handler and of a great dog. Cool, calm, even when things are not going right. Keeps moving the stickers around to try and shake them up. It can be so yeah. frustrating. Yeah. We've got them, yeah. we've got them. Oh, well done. Come through, Queenie. Take them out. Take, push them away. Push them away. Watch that they don't break back to the packet. Oh, he's got the shed. He's got the shed, as I should think, almost on time. He can't have a lot of time left. In fact, he's two minutes left. Two minutes left, and he could get the pen. He could get the pen, yes, although the packet of Hello. sheep that have got to be got rid of, Hello. Queen's driven them away down past the, the pen. Come on, lass. Let's have these sheep in this pen. Oh, this is getting really, getting really, getting really exciting, and he's got full mark, full marks for his shedding, a clean shed, and worthily so. The frustration there, she overcame it, yeah, yeah, and yeah, now yeah. we're in trouble. Now we're in trouble. She's lost the three sheep, and yeah, 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 he'll yeah. lose points for letting those sheep, rip, and they're going to rejoin. They're going to rejoin, and it's all falling apart. Well done, Queen, for what she did. But then, of course, the anticlimax again. It falls apart, and the points go. Lost the points, so the North win this particular round. Glyn Jones and Bullish Staff go to the top on this. But well done, Queen. That's all I can say. Sticking at it. <laughs>